Oh, it started. Okay, good. And we're here we go. <laughs> I'm Donna Lynn, by the way. You're Donna Lynn. Way to jump in there first. And I'm Pastor Brian. And here we are for midweek update with Pastor Brian and Donna Lynn. And we're decorated for Christmas. So. Yes. Yay. And uh, yeah, Christmas is coming. It's great. It is coming. And oh, we did not get the 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 deal. You know the thing. You know, you asked me for it, and I said, "Yeah, sure, not a problem." Oh, right. I understand now. <laughs> I think I'll be okay. You get it. Yeah. I got the deal in the thing. Right. Yeah. Christmas food boxes. Yes. And so yes, um, sent out a mailing mm -hmm. uh, to everybody in the church anyway, and included that on what uh, people can. Um, I mean, you always Do. canned vegetables are great. Right. I know we're going to be meeting together this Sunday, so feel free yep. to bring that. I see we have um, a bunch of cake mixes already in and cereal, and I see some peanut butter out there <laughs> and, and all kinds of goodies. So thank you to those who have already been providing. I also know that people have been um, financially um, giving to this project, mm -hmm. and so if you, if you do that, oh. Uh, make sure you mark on your um, envelope Christmas food box right. and and that will get into the right into the fund if you hand me money or a check that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna <laughs> put it in one of the little giving envelopes yes and, and put it right in the box in the box <laughs> because I don't yeah. keep any of the money Janice is wonderful she she uh, reimburses me for anything that I that I spend so yeah. So yeah. And uh, I notice how people in the church, they still don't trust the pastor when peanut butter's around <laughs> <laughs> because people brought peanut butter, but it's all creamy, knowing that the pastor will not dip into that. He because, has never done that. No, I don't so do it's creamy okay peanut to bring butter. The so crunchy. if you are afraid the pastor's got sticky fingers and going to like snag some office peanut butter, <laughs> Just bring creamy because I'll leave it alone. I know you'll leave. The I will leave alone. it alone. I, he, I will. You'll even leave the crunchy. I have alone. my own stash. He does. He really does. <laughs> Everywhere. I don't think he even lets it go for only just. Oh one no, on I'm hand. I'm stocked up. He, he I am keeps stocked it up. Stocked. I have a jar here at the office. I got one downstairs at home and one upstairs in the kitchen. That's it. I thought you. Had That's like, it. No, okay. I, I don't there... have peanut butter in the bathroom or anything. That would be weird. Just gummy bears. <laughs> oh, anyway. So what else we? Oh, hey, guess what? Next. This coming Sunday, we're gonna have live and in-person church. Woohoo! Yes, you I know, know. Last Sunday was kind of weird for me. Oh, so I didn't weird. feel like I had church. So weird. It was. Yeah. Well, the kids were here. That's and, true. Yeah. Um. But yes, we did the the online church mm -hmm. because of the freeze and yeah. so freeze tag is over this week and so we can go back to normal uh let's see the new standard is for churches is 25 mm -hmm. percent of your fire marshal capacity uh up to 100 mm -hmm. and so we're just fine we you know that's what we've been doing uh, i talked with don hopkins and he's on the fire board. I asked him, so what's the fire marshal capacity for the church? He, he didn't know. And, mm -hmm. But he said, ah, you just take the highest number you've ever had in the building and then add 25 and there it is. And so I don't think that's exactly how this works, but <laughs> we did hear from the fire department. So we do have an official or semi-official number, but yeah, no, we're we're we're, fine. we're totally fine. The bottom fine. line we're is we're totally we're okay. fine. Yes, no, good, good stuff. Yeah, no, we're not going to turn anybody away and say no. Nope, we got too many people. Uh, no, we're just fine. And so that's good stuff. I'm looking forward to actually having church with human beings. And let's see, we're gonna have um, candles. <laughs> what no, you're thanks. laughing at me? Um, because. <sighs> Donalyn does that. Yeah. So I Donalyn was just going to say, so what you're trying to say is that we're just fine, right? <laughs> so you know he was going to punch me. So yes, Advent. It is Advent <laughs> Sunday, right? And that's the kind of candles that you're referring to, correct? I'm going to keep my mouth shut. <laughs> I, I'm going to pray this prayer that I pray a lot. Dear Lord, what did I do to deserve this woman? 
She always takes it in a good way, though. Yes, yes. I mean, I really do. <laughs> yes. No, we're going to do the Advent candles yes. this year. We don't, I don't know. Who's going to light them? I, J- Janice is going to get people to light candles. Oh. So, so if, you'd I like, mean, yay. if you'd like to light candles, talk to Janice. Um, but yeah, she's got a little thing, well, that's good. scripture to read, and then have different family oh, light the candles fun. on Sunday mornings. Okay, okay, that makes yeah, sense. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, yeah, so they're we're not there. they're not there right now, but they will be this Sunday. Uh, so yeah, we're we are getting into Christmas. It's great, and um, yes, yes. I've only bought for the dog. Yeah. He was easy. Christmas shopping. It's it's not as exciting it's, it's, as I thought. Well, as I, it's just, it's, I don't know what to do. Um, right. So, also, this Saturday, yes, the guys are going out Saturday morning to go get Christmas trees. And, oh, I'll be happy when we get trees. I don't know. I People call the church all the time. Yes, we are getting trees. I have signs up. It's great. And uh, so I put it on the Facebook page, too. Uh, We're getting trees uh, Saturday, December 5th, and they'll be here sometime in the afternoon. Um, And so I I nicely say this this isn't really a Christmas tree store. This is just a fundraiser for the men's group. So, Uh, But, yeah, we got trees coming. And so we're we're getting organized. And I, I, it's, yeah, we'll see how this goes. I'm afraid it's going to be so cold Saturday. It was cold this morning when I was up. So anyway, if you want to come do trees, Daryl really needs a head count for uh, feeding people. Um, we need a head count ahead of time. And we'll be here at the church at 7 a.m. Saturday. And it's going to be, nope. Yeah. Yes. So if Daryl needs a head count, what right. is the easiest way to get this head count? Talk to Daryl. Yeah, okay. <laughs> that sounds like a great idea. Right. <laughs> don't yeah, don't tell me, I'll just forget. Uh so yes, we got Christmas food boxes, Christmas trees. We are actually meeting in person. It's great. We had oh, the kids were at our house. And so we got to see the kids, and you get to see your favorite dog. Uh, and yeah. so. And he likes you too. Well, of course he likes me. Every dog likes me because dogs know when there's somebody who, who's not like a huge fan. It's not that I hate dogs or anything. It's just I'm not a fan. I don't get it. And and every dog loves me because they're trying to win me over. And Walter yes. just loves me. <laughs> Yeah, so, uh, yeah, I don't know, we, let's see, this Sunday, I am talking about the Hallmark movie of the Bible, and <laughs> I know, and so, it's, it'll, it'll work out in the end. Okay. <laughs> there will be true love, and they'll live happily ever after. <laughs> this is going to be a great movie. It is going to be a great, oh, I'm ex- it's Are you going to act anything out? No, I'm not going to act it out, I'm sorry. Did you want to act things out? I could run up on stage. You and could. Get all, I don't even know. I don't know. I, I liked him to keep his sermons basically a surprise because <laughs> I like to, you know, enjoy yeah. it like, like all of you do too. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, that's coming up this Sunday okay. and it's going to be awesome. I'm excited. And so I think that's about all we got here, right? I think so. We're into December. Happy December. Woohoo. Um, oh, yeah. It's December second today. Yes, that is a true story. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Years ago, on a Tuesday afternoon at Good News Club, is when seven-year-old Brian Mm -hmm. uh, accepted Jesus into his heart on December 2nd. Um, Yeah, a long time ago. Um, And I wrote that in my Bible when I was a kid, and so that's why I remember that date you know very clearly and um, and this is what it's all about here we are heading to Christmas Jesus mm-hmm. came to us he made that first move towards us and will we invite him into our lives and yeah. so hey let me pray for you dear Lord we thank you that you did send Jesus uh, that you love the world so much that you sent your son 
that whoever believes in him would not perish but have eternal life. And Lord, we thank you that we can celebrate that at Christmas. Uh, Lord, we pray during this, this COVID Christmas that we could turn to you uh, all the more uh, because we need you. Uh, we just recognize uh, these days how much we need you. Uh, Lord, we pray that you would bless each one watching, listening today. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. All right. There we go. It's been blinking at me. I'm still smiling. Okay. There. Nope.